Hello YouTube, Jake from Stage 2 here bringing you a quick tutorial on how to open a form from within a form. So here we have form 1, I'm just going to go to project, add windows form, make sure windows form is selected and then I'm going to press add. I'm not going to rename this form. Alright, I'm going to go back to form 1, click on toolbox select button and I'm going to click on the form to add this button and I'm going to rename the button to open form 2 you can name this whatever you want but for this tutorial that's what we're going to name it alright you can right click the button and press view code if you'd like to view the code that way but it's much easier to double click the button and that will automatically put the subheader there for you and show you the form uh, code page so here we're going to type form 2 dot show and there we have that All right. and then we're going to test this so we're going to click start at the top the green arrow and wait for it here we have form 1, I'm going to click open form 2 and here we can see the second form has now loaded but form 1 stayed open, what if you want that to hide? that's easy, we go back to form 1's code underneath where it says form 2.show we type me.hide that's done now, we're going to go to the second form and add a button because we want to be able to get back to the first form once that's hiding and we're going to type show form 1 as the name of that button for this tutorial and I'm just going to resize this a bit alright we're going to double click on that button and we're going to type form 1 dot show and underneath there me dot hide so now if we give this a quick test you can see here that we have the first form and then the second form and then it'll open each and hide itself when you press the button so that's done and um, it's very important that you always refer to a form when a form is referring to itself it must refer to itself as me and not by its name so here it says me.hide and that's correct but if it was talking about itself and we typed its actual name form2.hide it would say there's a problem with that and that's because a form can't refer to itself in third person if you want but basically what it says is cannot refer to itself as a default instance that's the code error so we just change form 2 back to me.hide it's a quick that's an easy mistake but it, it's easy fix as well so there you go thanks for watching and see you next time